joined by Ben Elder from Chive. Hi, Ben. Tell us a bit about the inspiration behind Chive. So the initial concept was single stem flower vases. Uh, it was based in the US about 25 years ago. Uh, a chap called Todd uh, thought that he would try and design a product um, so that anyone could do flower arranging for their home without having to be a florist. They could just take a single stem and make the, the vase look nice so then it could just look nice in the home without having to worry about yeah like big bouquets and like getting all of the arrangements proper that's kind of the concept and then succulents came into fashion and so we just sort of adapted with the times essentially that's it and in terms of best sellers is there anything you've got a bit of a hunch is going to be the best seller for the year yeah we've got some new little metal pots over there and uh and they've they've gone really well so far um, just because they've, they've got a really good design. But also, to be honest, it's our, um, it's our ceramic flower range. It, they're, they're ridiculous. People come on and they just go, what is the point of this? And fundamentally, there is no point to it apart from it's decorative. And the entire purpose of it is for people to come on and go, that looks nice. And then they buy them for their houses. So. And over the last 18 months, there's been so much change in general life. How have you found your business has changed? We have pushed a little bit more towards retail so we were predominantly wholesalers but um so we obviously lost a bit of money on wholesalers whole, the wholesale side of it because well shops closed um online retailers still bought from us but the actual retail side of it picked up loads because obviously everybody was at home going can't do anything just want to order some stuff to to make my life a bit happier so the retail side of it went really well uh, and how are you finding how are you feeling about christmas trade yeah, good. Um, we always kind of spike at Christmas a bit, um, as I think probably most gift companies do. We have a lot of kind of Christmas orientated products along those metal ones that I was just talking about. Um, yeah, and now's the sort of time where people are starting to order for Christmas. So as long as we've got the stock in, we should be, we should be fantastic. And how does it feel to be back at Top Draw in the flesh? It's weird. It's really weird. It was coming in uh, on the first day and obviously, actually, the building has changed a lot. They're doing a lot of development work here. Um, but it was sort of seeing all these familiar faces from two years ago because uh, I know the organisers quite well and uh, it was like hi do we hug do we shake hands I don't know no we just do uh, yeah um, so it's really nice and actually they've done really well with the show like it's it's a little bit smaller than it has been before which is actually great it makes it more concise and more accessible and it feels busy and there's a buzz to it so it's great it's really nice brilliant thank you so much Ben